woman. He's half man, half woman. It's Gary. I want to hip you to the T. It's Gary, baby. All right, y'all, five minutes after the hour, Gary has the T in the color of the day. Gary. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Monday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Ricky, I don't know if you heard the sh- sad, shocking news, honey, and it might touch you. It's being reported, y'all, that... Doctor now, y'all, the star uh, doctor of the TLC series, My 600 Pounds, has been allegedly fired. Now, they're saying, y'all, that the series is potentially being canceled as well. Now, according to reports, y'all, they're saying, y'all, that um, the former, um, a former cast member proceeded to tell the media outlets, y'all, that they haven't actually had their stomach stapling surgery and are, actually, are currently stuck in limbo. Now, according to the cast member, there are some issues involving Dr. Now, the network, and the insurance involved in paying for the surgeries. The TLC the TLC doctor um, performed, y'all, and they're saying that it's not just 600 pounds that, you know, has gotten this surgery and what have you. They're saying, according to reports, there are nearly a dozen cast members that have been approved for the surgery but are now stuck in limbo. They're saying that the lawsuit is piling up against Dr. Now from former cancer members and their mem- um, family members in some cases, and they are being too expensive of a problem for TLC to want to deal with. But they will not, they will not start eating if you stop eating, you'll get cut out the program. Do you understand? <laughs> but you I get, can't stop eating. You get kicked so out the program, happened, you are the enabler. <laughs> you keep feeding her, she will die. <laughs> we need to get him on the phone. Yeah, yeah. can we get Dr. Now on the phone? Yeah. We bet we've been yeah. wanting to get him on the show. I believe we can do that. We yeah. love Dr. Now on my 600 pound life. That's, oh my well, God. Well, we're going to see, but we hate to leave him to leave because he's such a great doctor. I just like when he when he said what he got, yeah. the way he walked out that room. Yes. <laughs> yeah. He, he turned around, he opened that door, he walked out that room, he'd be disgusted because they ain't lost enough weight. Yep. And then uh-huh. put them on the diet. And they sent up here, uh, one episode where she done went and picked up 15 pieces to take to a party. <laughs> Got to the party, they had six pieces. <laughs> I, 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 I thought I w- missed something. I, w- I had to rewind it. What happened to the other? They done ate them on the way over yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, and they walked yeah. into that front door to that big ass party with six pieces. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, him and his pray, sister done sat in that car, had all the pieces on the, all, the back seat of that Ford Explorer. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're going to keep them lifted and prayer, And hopefully, you know, this is a rumor, but we're going to check it out and see. All Y'all, right. You saw the episode when she fried that chicken on her chest. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We yes, remember. I did. Plug that, oh. plug that hot skillet up and, and she was yeah. flouring that damn, that, making that chicken real crunchy. You dipping yes. it back and forth between the buttermilk and the flour. And then she go back to the buttermilk and back to the flour. She made sure that damn chicken was crunchy like churches. Yeah. And she, it. <laughs> it was. He was laying down. I don't know. And then she went, went between the matches and sprinkled some pap- some paprika, yeah. some paprika and some uh, parsley on the chicken to make the chicken yeah. look real good. And it was pretty. Oh, Oh my God, there it goes, Lord Jesus. Oh, well, we're going to keep our parties oh. lifted up in our prayer, y'all, honey. That's touching. All right, moving on. Another celebrity news, y'all. Jesse Williams, honey, we know the actor, the wonderful um, playwright and all that other good stuff. They're saying that Jesse Williams' child support has been reduced from a mere $40,000 to a Talk about from uh, uh, Empire? From, uh, no, they ain't Grey's the Empire. Anatomy, Grey's Jesse. Anatomy. They look alike, Ricky. They both light skin like Ron T. like to taunt. But no, they're, um, no, 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 not the same person. But anyway, they're giving her, they, they, they doing his wife dirty, Ricky. That one what was giving $40,000. Now they're giving her $6,000 a month. That oh, is what a she, sin. she deserves. <laughs> She don't deserve no damn six thousand dollars. Gary, that woman the got man two doesn't have. He doesn't work on Grey's Anatomy anymore. And He's that don't have nothing to do with the price of tea in China. He ha- well, he, he should keep his job and get a damn part time job. That woman, children are used to forty thousand dollars. Well, he don't work part time. Well, he right. doing that play. He, it has to do with the price of child support that she's getting. Six thousand dollars is more than enough money to take care of those two children, Gary. Well, you know what? They're not your children. You don't know where they live in. These children live, honey, in another town. They're not I know where their daddy don't work at and then somewhere to pay $40,000 a month. That's well, she's just sure. getting six, and I feel bad for Aaron, honey. They need to do something about it, honey. She needs to file another case against him, honey, because he needs oh, to pay her. No. I mean, she's used to that. He was paying it. I mean, he knew they needed to have him. Boy, so they're they going from 40000 to 6000 You got the budget. Oh, yeah, that's a big budget. But do she work? 
She's an attorney, and then she's doing some okay, other if stuff. Okay, she, if she's an attorney, she's she working. She, she's straight. Yeah, but that's her job. That has nothing to do with him. His job was taking care of those kids, and he was an Are the kids with him half of the time? I'm sure they go to him half of the time and stuff, so now they're yeah. going to go from 40 to 6. That's a big drop. Right, I mean, and I, you feel sorry for him. I feel extremely <laughs> sorry for him. Yeah, yeah. Now, her kids going to be like the rest of the kids. How are they going to be a white woman or a black woman? Oh, no, she's very black, and she deserves black. to have that, honey. You know. So you need the money to go back into the system. Yes, because now how her kids going to go to school. You know how the, the black children are. Oh, you got oh, look! You got on some cheerleader tennis shoes. We got on these here. No, right. not, 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 not they out there with Paw Patrol shoes on. Everybody else, <laughs> everybody else got on Louis Vuitton. Exactly. <laughs> right. so and no, they sir. get, get taunted for, have, for having on Peppa Pig yeah. uh, uh-uh. pants. Yeah, uh-uh. <laughs> be quiet. That ain't cute at all. So, honey, if I was, I wouldn't even send them to school. Then if they had to go looking like Garrett, six thousand dollars a month, you wouldn't send them to school. That's two children, Ricky. That ain't one. That's two. Look, Garrett, what they, what do they need? They need what their dad was allowing them when he was paying them for it. Forty thousand dollars, forty thousand. Oh, Louis Vuitton well, ain't fun, safe. man. Kids, but man, they love Paw Patrol the little shoes that light up, Gary. Those they, kids uh, don't go to school with Paw Patrol children. <laughs> oh, hell, you oh, crazy? Oh, <laughs> children yeah. they go. What is Paw Patrol? They, up, <laughs> yeah, they, they watch that. Gary. <laughs> what you think? They rich kids watch. watch? That. They don't watch no all Paw Patrol. Kids rich that. kids, all they kids do. watch Paw Patrol. Yeah, but Gary. it's a different Paw Patrol. They got different ones. They got those for the inside, <laughs> and those for the west side. So they got Section A Paw Patrol. That's right. Yeah. Uh, I feel so bad for him, honey. I just, I don't know. It's we got to pray. Good. We got to pray, honey, night and day. All right, my quick for free story. Y'all. Idris Elba is speaking out, y'all. He talked about once before he became the big star he is, he used to sell drugs, honey. And he said one of his clients happened to be um, Dave Chappelle. He said Dave Chappelle used to buy weed from him. He was a bouncer at the club, and Dave Chappelle he used to sell weed, and Dave Chappelle used to buy something from him, he said. Which I don't like that. Why are people talking? Yeah, got to keep that. You know? I mean, that's not yeah, Nobody a good needed to know that. Uh, thank right. you. Why do people do it? Why celebrities talk on the other one? What's that about? They had I mean, to buy us from somewhere. Yeah, but don't tell who it was, who was buying it, because right. I mean, he already like a drug head, but no, I wouldn't, you know. <laughs> but anyway, there's neither here nor there. All right, the Kahlua today, honey, is one of my favorite Kahlua. My Kahlua today, y'all, which we changed the Kahlua, honey, is Frankie Beverly. On the high end, you say Frankie don't Beverly. Do that. And on the low end, you say beautiful white. Y'all ain't gonna That's do that. That's the Kahlua for hey, today. Ain't nothing wrong with my outfit. Y'all can go to hell. <laughs> 12 minutes after the hour, then he's gonna play Frankie Beverly Maze. <laughs> Black folks' favorite song before I let go. Uh, I do not look like Frank and Beverly Mays today. This is Nike. I don't care who it is, it's white. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's there cool. you go. <laughs> it's white, honey. Take a picture and smile. <laughs> Said that I've been acting different, yeah. Funny how I find.